Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 3 of A Girl and Her Guard Dog. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Damn, you that bad? Yeah. I mean, you an adult. You should know your ish. Oh my god. Right? You still need to do work and everything else, duh. <laughs> Little things that you use out in the real world, duh. Oh, hush. She didn't know. Uh, funny. <laughs> mm. That's because he is. That's also because he is. No. Just really good friends. Shit, because I'm dating them.
Ja. You look so good in that tux, oh my god. Uh. Uh oh! Yeah, I mean, you've been there all day. You jealous? <clears throat> oh my god. <laughs> yeah, let's say that. Aww. So you can't be mad at him. He's so cute. Cute and hot. Fucking himbo. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> yeah, he just knocked out. He sleep. wake up though so I, I wouldn't try <laughs> We're not going to talk about what happened. Really? Are you serious about that? Very studious about that? God.
<laughs> Not while she's in the bath, damn it. We well, did better. Of course, it's still about the fucking award. Oh. <laughs> Didn't say that. Huh? Wait, you kiss me. You can't kiss her. No. Okay, what? The whole day? Don't treat it like a date. It's just you two hanging out. You can sleep. Now I know if it was me going on a date with him, fuck no, I don't think I could sleep. Not until like three or four in the morning. <laughs> You remember that too? Damn. Oh. <laughs> True. I thought you would have wanted to, like, go somewhere else besides the zoo. Not that I mind him going to the zoo. I think that's cute. Huh? Yeah, and then plus you short, baby. Um, sir. <laughs> Please put her down. Yes.
<laughs> well, yeah, I mean, she tried to hold hands with you, but then you said something, you know. Aww. Look at the bunny. <laughs> Girl. <laughs> Oh, damn. <laughs> bunny like. <laughs> it's still hard, the bunny. Oh, my God. He's so sweet to do all that. Oh, my God. Girl, I'd be, I'd be wiping him up so damn quickly. Oh, my God. Nothing. Oh my god. The fact that he said that like so normally, oh my god. You gotta love fucking anime already adding this. I can't. Uh. Okay. Oh. I get that. We've all done that. The outfit is cute, though.
acknowledging it. <laughs> of course, she didn't like that. You can't, you can't fall in love with them, like, I mean, I can, I know I can. Of course they would end it right there. The fact that he, like, in the final moments, had to also bring up, like, oh yeah, we only associate kissing also with sex and everything. I mean, yeah, I, I totally get that, because there's two different types of kissing. There's ones with emotion and passion, and in the heat of the moment, and then sometimes, depending on if you're just someone looking to just, like, have a good time with someone, and it's not, like platonic and everything and you just want to have sex with someone to just have sex with someone yeah the kissing with that i'm guessing it's you know psh, nothing you feel nothing and stuff it's almost like when you do kiss someone for the first time like it, especially if it's someone you like you feel so many different emotions butterfly is never or even when you like when it's like the a kiss on a webcam, even though you're you're not physically together, but you just feel like you can t feel someone else's lips, like. I can't. With myself. But still, he fine. I guess I'm in a heartbeat. The date, or just, because it is still a date regardless, even if it's two people hanging out and stuff. It was sweet. Of course, like, every single moment that happened, I was just, like, taking her out and putting me in. Like the bad bitch that I am. But even him picking her up and drawing attention to them. Oh my god. Poor baby. I feel for her. Because it's like, no, you don't want that. Like, yes, I get it. She's short baby. Like, you want to pick her up and just be like, yes, look at my child. Oh my god. But you can't do that, sir. Seriously. You are embarrassing her. And such. Like, yeah, he's being, he's being a parent right there and there. And they're then embarrassing the hell out of her because you know of course our parents do the craziest things to embarrass us but they only do it out of love i do also like the fact that she got to see that family take the picture together and do the kiss on the little girl because she gets to see like oh hey now i kind of understand what they mean by that type of kiss but i don't think he was meaning that's the type of kiss he wanted to do now him kissing her hair Weak in the knees, bitch. Oh my god. Or even at the beginning when the lady, who clearly is attracted to him, kissed him. And he, in that moment, he felt nothing. He maybe did feel something. But of course, he's like, I can't shove her away for the number one woman in my life, which is officially her. Even though, it ain't gonna work out with these two. We all know it ain't gonna fucking work out with these two. Um... But yeah, like I said, overall, this was an interesting type of episode. I do also like the fact that, you know, he really put his mind on studying and stuff, even though still he wanted a reward at the end of the day, because, you know, typical guys, they always want something, you know, we tell them no, when they're like, I can't take no for an answer. Not all guys. Some guys, just remember that, boys. Like, I'm not saying all guys are bad. I've met some good ones. Some of y'all are some good ones, too. Y'all are out there, I know. Mm-hmm, yes. You're good. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but this was a really interesting episode for how everything was portrayed and stuff. I love the fact that even though everything in any moment that they have together it's just like yes it's cute but like I said I'm like I, I still don't feel anything when it's her but when I'm looking when I'm imagining me oh shit I'm feeling everything but the fact the man cooked fucking cooked 
once again I wife him up in a heartbeat a motherfucking heartbeat like shit <laughs> I would I probably wouldn't give a crap if he was in the Yakuza or the Mafia or anything I'd be like yeah I'd be like you cook I mean I cook too but you cook I need you in my life. Please and thank you. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction to be towards episode three of A Girl and Her Guard Dog. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Thursday for episode four. Bye, guys.